Welcome back to Anything German Shepherd. In this video, you'll learn all about the Belgian Malinois German Shepherd mix's history, personality, coat, training, exercise needs, and health issues. Hopefully this information will help you decide if the German Malinois might be the perfect dog for you and your family. What sets this hybrid dog breed apart is that the Belgian Malinois and the German Shepherd are arguably the two top protection canines in the world. These breeds also share similar origin stories as working livestock, herding, and guarding dogs. More recently, Belgian Malinois became one of the first dog breeds to work with the police, while German Shepherds first rose to prominence while serving in the German army, and later in the American police and military forces. In terms of temperament and personality, this should be fairly predictable in these dogs since the two parent breeds share similar backgrounds. Some owners describe the Belgian Malinois like a German Shepherd on steroids giving us a great idea of how active, energetic, and intense a Belgian Malinois can be. So we can safely assume that the German Malinois will be just as, if not more, high energy than the parent dogs. Both parent dogs are intensely people-focused, have high prey drives, chase instincts, and won't like being left alone too frequently. In terms of coat type and shedding pattern, both parent breeds have medium-length double-layer coats that shed heavily year-round and seasonally. Regular brushing is definitely recommended to reduce shedding and the amount of fur around your house. But other than that, their grooming requirements aren't too demanding. On average, a German Malinois will weigh around 65 pounds and stand 24 inches tall. Although they're not overly large dogs, the most challenging aspect of owning a Belgian Malinois German Shepherd mix will be training and providing enough daily exercise. These dogs are highly intelligent and very keen to have some kind of job or activity to do. Given their unique mix of traits and powerful size, starting puppy socialization and training right away, ideally from your first day at home together, will be very important. Although mixed breed dogs are generally healthier, Belgian Malinois and German Shepherd breed lines both have some serious genetic health issues. The mixed breed dog will therefore still be at risk of developing hip dysplasia, eye and cardiac issues, autoimmune thyroiditis, and degenerative myelopathy. Despite this, these dogs will still live for about 14 years on average and should make great family companions overall. With that being said, you'll still need to be cautious if you have young kids. The GSD Malinois' herding instincts may cause them to nip at the heels of younger kids, and their prey instincts may make them want to chase other family pets or even little kids. Thanks for joining us today. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the like button. We'll see you next time.